Home Studio Universal can be sued for false advertising after two fans complained a movie trailer was misleading. As judge has ruled, the fans of the actress Ana de Armas filed a lawsuit in January after renting the 2019 film yesterday. The actress was seen in the trailer, but the pair were disappointed to find she had been cut from the final film. The plaintiffs, Connor Wolf and Peter Michael Rocha, each paid $3.99331 to rent yesterday on Amazon Prime. Wolf and Rocha are seeking at least $5 million for 1M from Universal in the case, which has been filed as a class action on behalf of other disappointed fans. The pair argued they would not have paid the money to rent the film if they had known the actress did not feature in it. California US District Judge Stephen Wilson ruled that their legal action can go ahead. Universal, the studio behind the film, sought to throw out the lawsuit, arguing that movie trailers are entitled to broad protection under the First Amendment, which protects free speech rights and the press. The studio's lawyers argued that a trailer is an artistic, expressive work that tells a three-minute story conveying the theme of the movie and should therefore be considered non-commercial speech.